All right, video time. Today's video is gonna be a uh, follow up to yesterday's video. All right, so after a few hours of this video being up, uh, published and stuff, one question keeps popping up. How do you make this box work with 12 volts and 24 volts? The question that comes in many forms is like, when are we making a box like this for 12 volts? And the answer is right here already. This one already works. I don't know why, I think, cause I figured that everybody was going to want to make this into a 48 volt battery. There, but there's a lot of you guys that don't want 48. That you're gonna wanna stick with 12 or, you know, 24 or whatever. So. This is how you do it, right? This is uh, another box right here in the midst of uh, being put together. So the only thing that makes this into a 48, it's uh, literally this board right here. It's PCB and it's not included in the kit. So you have to uh, purchase this separately, which I thought it was a bad thing at first, but then now I'm like thinking, oh, there we go. No, it's a good thing because now you don't have to buy this. You could simply not put it on there. And instead of buying that one, you can buy the 24 volt boards that we have on our website. These are available there and is to make 24 uh, volt batteries. So how would they go? Let's, All right. So let's say that you did that. So now this is negative and then this is positive. So let's see, how do you do the other one? Okay, so the other one, you do the same thing. Now this is two 24 volt batteries side to side. So here's a negative and here's the positive. And if you wanna connect these together, you just go from positive to positive here, right? And then from negative to negative. And now this is the most negative and then this is the most positive. Now you have a 24 volt battery that is not 74 amp hours, but it's 148 amp hours, right? Now, let me check on this BMS. Okay, so unfortunately I checked and this BMS uh, can only handle 10S to 16S. So this is 8S. So we're just, it's weird that they don't go 8S because it'd be 24. It's a very popular voltage, right? So you will have to get a different BMS. You can't use the same one that, uh, well, we have designed for this one right here, but no big deal. I mean, you can, you can get another one, any BMS and just install it right here. And then now you have your 24 volt, 148 amp hour battery pack, right? On this same box. Now let's say that you wanted to do 12. Let's do 12 now. Now these, you could also buy them on uh, jack35.com. They're available there. Let's see how would these go. Positive, negative. Okay, so it would go right here and then negative. And then this one right here. All right, so there we go. So basically now you get four positives. Positive here, positive here, you tie this one's together, then you tie it with this one, and then with this one, and then these are all the negatives. There's four negatives, you tie those together, and now you have a 12 volt battery that is 148 times two, whatever that is. 296 amp hours. It's still gonna be the 3.7 kilowatt hour, right? It's just, you're gonna have more amp hours, right? And less voltage, that's how that works. Uh, also the same thing, you will have to get another BMS that can handle, by the way, this battery right here is very, very powerful. It's gonna be able to handle about a thousand amp continuous, right? So this is a monster of a 12 volt battery once you to choose a BMS that will be able to handle those levels of power, right? This, crazy a thousand amps continuous this would be you can build it and you can house it in this same enclosure that we've made so this essentially is 16 cell enclosure is not just limited to 48 volts right uh maybe we're gonna change the name on that one so that uh, it reflects better what this box can do
time in history. Take a look at this fool. I mean, just look at him. Is that guy normal? I don't think he's all there. Uh, oh, he is low IQ. An example of the lowest kind in our society. And if he can do it. And if he can do it. What does that say about you? So, just get up and do it. Are you really going to wait until a complete collapse of the electrical grid to worry about this? Are you really going to wait? What does that say about you? Just wait until all the lights go off and your precious TikTok goes dark. You oblivious fool, don't be that guy. Well, are you? Seize the moment. Build it, build it, build it, build the power wall.